hi good people welcome to our youtube channel and i hope that you guys are enjoying the content that we are making so in today's video you are going to work on something very small something very brief but very important when it comes to asc timetables so in today's video i'm going to show you how we create breaks in ASC timetable. It's a very simple tutorial, a very simple procedure that I hope that you guys are going to enjoy. But before we get started, kindly good people, subscribe to this channel, uh, turn on the notification bell, share this video and also give it a thumbs up. That will be a very, a very great achievement to us. We have made uh, several videos on the ASC timetable we've made a video on how you can download this software we have made a video on how you can configure this software to work without even paying for it and you guys just check the videos I've just uploaded and you're going to get all the content that you've done on ASC timetable so in today's video we have a very short clip that you're going to work on how we create breaks on ASC timetable let's get started so welcome back to our channel let's get to learn how we create uh, breaks in ASC timetable software so I'm going to visit this section where we have the school so I'm gonna click there and then I'll have this section being opened and then the next part that I'm going to open is bell times stroke rename period so I'm gonna click there and you can see that I've already created my timetable. I have already allocated the times that I need. So the next thing I'm going to do is now to add breaks that will be printed between lessons. So I want to add my first break between 9.30 and 9.40 because you can see that the second lesson ends at 9.30 and the third lesson starts at 9.40. So I'm going to add a break in a break uh, of 10 minutes in between 10 30 and 10 40 so you click that area and then you name this section short break i'm going to name my break as short break so the next thing i'm going to do is to look, to choose where my break will be and this is just before lesson two and we have it so the break will be created uh, from 9 30 all the way to 9 40 and once i'm done with that i just click ok and that will be saved so you from in this particular section you can see that we have already created a break so i'm going to create my second break and my second break will be between 11 sharp and 11 30 because you can see that my third lesson ends at 11 sharp and my fourth lesson starts at 11 30 meaning that we have around 30 minutes that have no allocation so i'm going to add my break just there so it is just before uh, i mean before the fourth lesson so i'm going to name my break as long break long break and then i will copy that instead of retyping again i'm just going to copy that and then paste it again in this section and then choose where my my break will be and of course you can see that it will start from 11 sharp all the way to 11 30 so my break is okay i'm gonna click that so i'm going to add one more break so this one will be my lunch break which will start from 9 i mean sorry uh, 12 50 all the way to 1 30 yeah that will be good yeah so i have a break here that is uh, that is between between the fifth and the sixth lesson so it must come before the sixth lesson so I'm going to name I have to name this one as uh, lunch break lunch break we have that so I'm gonna copy that and then paste it in our short uh, break section and then it should come before the sixth lesson should be now we are going to uh, to adjust this area all the way to from 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 1250 to 13 all the way to 1330 1330 so that will be very fine and you can see that you already have our lesson so once we are done with that the next thing that you do is just click 
okay and your information will be saved in your computer so that's all about creating break sections in ASC timetable thank you for your time guys